Today I'm going to show you how to set up Super Mario Eclipse, which is the largest mod for Super Mario Sunshine. There is a full release and it has been long awaited. You can play this on Dolphin or on your console as long as you have a way to play GameCube game set up. If you don't, I have tutorials on how to set up Dolphin with a GameCube controller adapter, as well as how to set up Nintendo emulator on the Wii and Wii U. And a quick disclaimer for Nintendo, I am not going to be showing you how to get any paid software illegal legally in this guide. Along with the way to play, you also need the ISO backup of Super Mario Sunshine. But if you have all of that, let's get started by going to the link in the description. It'll take us to Game Banana here for the official release of Super Mario Eclipse. We have a channel trailer here. This was made by the Eclipse team and it has all the credits down below in this section. So big shout out to everybody who put work into this mod. But if you keep scrolling down, we will have the download here and that is what we're going to grab. So click on that and then click on download here. But once it's downloaded, we can minimize our browser and open up our downloads. And before we open it, I'm going to create a new folder. You can create this folder anywhere on your computer. I'm just going to call it SME mod. Let's open up the zip file. You will need an extraction software like WinRAR or 7-Zip to extract this, but we're gonna highlight everything in here and place it inside of the folder we created. You don't have to place the folder on the desktop. You can place it wherever you want. I put it on my desktop for ease of access. We can now exit the zip file and delete it off our computer. Now, if you have an RVZ, game file like this one we can convert it using dolphin so you just need to make sure you have this file into your dolphin games folder so i'll drag it inside i already have it i'll just replace it dolphin can read these files but we need the iso so we're going to right click on super mario sunshine and hit convert file and as long as iso is selected press convert it'll open up your games directory and we can save it there it will simply convert the file and there we go, Suc successfully converted. Press OK. We can minimize that. Go into your Dolphin Games directory, and you should see the converted file right here. So this is what we want. So I'm gonna keep this open because we will need that ISO in a sec and open up the folder where we extracted the files to. So you should see a bat file, drag your USA Sunshine ISO on this bat. Super simple, that is exactly what we're gonna do. So grab the ISO we just converted and drag it onto it. And a command window will open up right here and it will run through patching the ISO with the mod. And there we go. You should see this screen. And if we move the command window, you should see Super Mario Eclipse in that same folder as a .iso. If when you converted it, it gave you an error saying bad copy, that means it might not be USA, it might be modified, or it's not ISO format. If it is ISO format, I suggest trying to go find a RVZ and converting it like we just did earlier. And if you keep getting errors and you can't get it to work, you can join my Discord server for further troubleshooting help. Now this here is a Windows program. So if you're on Mac, I will link a Reddit post with an awesome guide on how to do that. It's a little bit more complicated and I don't have a Mac to show you. So you're welcome to follow this guide right here. But now we can press any key to continue and you should see Super Mario Eclipse. And that is literally all we do. Now we have our game. I'm gonna cut and paste it into my Dolphin game directory. I'm gonna exit there now, we don't need this anymore. Also, I don't need this RVZ file, so I'm gonna delete that as well. I would suggest keeping a backup of this game, uh, so if you, anything happens to your hard drive or anywhere that you store it, you always have a place to grab it. If you are setting this up on console, I will quickly show you where to place it there. So if you're setting it up on your Wii or Wii U, it's the same thing, we are going to right click. If you don't have a games folder already, make one, and just all lowercase, just games, uh, if you already have Nintendo set up, you should already have that folder. But all we gotta do is drag the Super Mario Eclipse ISO. We're gonna copy it into that folder. And it's not set up yet. We're gonna go inside of that folder. And now we need to right click, create a new folder and call it Super Mario Eclipse. We are going to drag the ISO file inside, go inside again. And now we need to rename this. So right click, rename and just call it game. So it should look just like that, game.iso. That is the proper setup for games for Nintendo. If you want a more in-depth tutorial on Nintendo, look in the description and you can find one there. But now we have it on our Wii U and my Dolphin. So let's go make sure it's there. 
There it is, even a custom cover, it looks fantastic. But as long as you have your controller set up, let's start it up. But there you go guys, you now have the file to play Super Mario Eclipse. If I helped you out, please make sure to hit that like button, it really helps me out. And subscribe for more modding tutorials in the future. Stay funky and happy modding. <laughs>